Today I'm going to go over a new phone mount solution I recently installed in my Elantra Inn. This is a new phone mount and holder from ProClip. I originally wanted a ProClip mount when I purchased my car, but unfortunately one was not available at that time. I really like ProClip's products as they are well built and integrate nicely into your vehicle's interior. I enjoyed having a ProClip mount and holder in my GTI, which is how I got hooked onto their products. I like how their mounts are modular and allow customers to change the fold phone holder while keeping the same mount if a customer decides to change their phone. They also have options for magnetic and powered phone holders. For my Elantra, I chose to go with a standard holder. I have an iPhone 13 mini with a smartish case. With the style of case that I have, the adjustable holder for small to medium cases was the best choice for my phone. This is a more expensive product than most phone mounts, but I feel it's worth the money, as you'll see in the video. Typically, if you sign up for ProClip's mailing list, you'll save 15% off your first order. I'll have a link to their product in the video description. Also, I am not sponsored or paid by ProClip to make this video or advertise their product. As previously stated, this is a modular kit, so when you go to ProClip's website, you will enter your car, then pick your mount if multiple options are available, and then pick your phone holder. There's only one mount available for the Elantra, which is to the lower right side of the infotainment screen inside the air vent. The design of the mount allows you to install the mount in between the air vent while still maintaining a full functioning vent. To begin installing the mount, you will clean the vent with the included alcohol swab. Next, peel the blue backing off the double-sided tape. Make sure the ProClip logo is facing up. Install the top of the mount into the vent first and then push the bottom of the mount into the vent. The product is stiff and will take some force to pop into the vent. Once in, you will need to adjust the mount until it feels locked into the vent. Now for the phone holder. The mount provides two positions for the phone holder. I separated the mounting plate from the phone holder, then tested to see where I wanted to mount the holder. I chose to mount the holder on the right side of the mount. Using the supplied screws, screw the holder to the mount. As a free gift, I received a couple of wire holders with my order. I found these to be a nice addition as they cleaned up my charging cable and positioned the wire directly underneath the phone holder. The two wire holders are held into place by double-sided tape. With the wire in place, I prepared the phone holder to hold my phone before installing it onto the mount. Unscrew the two small screws at the top and bottom of the phone holder. This will allow you to open up the sides of the phone holder. Position your phone in between the holder and press the sides to your phone. Make sure the phone is in the front grooves of the holder. The bottom of the phone should be at the bottom groove of the holder. Once you have the phone set where it can be inserted into the mount without being too tight, remove the phone and re-tighten the two screws. Install the phone holder to the mount by screwing the phone holder to the mount using the center screw. After you have the phone holder attached, test your phone to make sure you can easily slide the phone in and out of the mount without the phone dropping out of the holder. I 
I love this product and I think it looks great in the car. Please let me know what you think of this product and if you have one in your car. Also, let me know what you're using for your phone mount. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe for more content.